guys, and welcome back to Love for Plants. Today we're going to talk about our plants that we don't like. Um, most people pick plants like the nerve plant or the polka dot plant. They say they're drama. Those plants are drama. However, <laughs> when that plant is thirsty, it lets you know. Don't miss it um, for another day or the plant dies. But if you catch it on time, that plant just comes back and it, it looks beautiful again. Um, so yes, they're drama but they don't lose their appearance. Um, this thing is my plant that I, I don't even know why I'm growing it anymore. I've had it for over a year, maybe a year and a half. It's grown a lot, it's gotten tall, um, but this is my drama plant. And I, if this is all it's gonna look like, I'm, I'm done with it. Um, and I know a lot of you guys are like, oh my gosh, that's a Monstera. It's it's the Swiss cheese, you know. I thought, oh, it's so cool, I want it. Totally overrated in my opinion. Um, so I'm gonna go over this Swiss cheese plant. Um, this thing does not like to be watered. And I water it less than I do my cacti, I believe. Most of my succulents, I water more than I water this thing. Um, I do have some nice vines on it, it does look okay. Then you get a leaf like this. This is from overwatering this plant. That is the only time I get leaves that turn colors is right after watering. Um, I have a ton of stuff in here for drainage. There's actually a cement brick in the inside, so it's not like this whole pot is holding dirt and holding moisture. Um, but anytime I water it, like I will fill a cup like this, and this is all the water I give it, and I pour it around the top. And within a day to two days, I have a leaf that has a yellow spot. Um, so it's, I, you know, I don't even know when to water it anymore. It, it just doesn't look pretty. So every, every time I'm done watering, like here's another one, I'll end up picking those leaves off eventually. Now I do have plants way up high, or the plant goes way up high. Um, not in camera view, so let me fix that. And it has leaves. The leaves look really good. They're not very big. The leaves are very small. Um, that's my hand for size. They're very small. It is getting new growth. I mean, it looks good. This is where I struggled at one point and lost a lot. Um, but I just think this plant should be bigger and it should have more color. Um, something about it just being green. I thought, you know, all the pictures I saw, it was like big, beautiful green holes. It's really just, to me, it's not all it's cracked up to be. It's not even, like, there's no shades of anything in this leaf. It's just green, which is good. It, that means good things, but I don't know. I look at it, and it's just not attractive. So this is my number one plant. <laughs> I am actually taking it off this post, um, and I'm giving it to a local lady, I may keep a little bit of a piece just so I don't feel terrible and change my mind. That way I still have a piece. Um, but this plant's got to go. It's, it's too much. I spray this post just to get the moss wet. And just the water that drips from the, the post to the bottom is enough to set this, this plant off. So this one's out. Um, I got to find out now what I'm going to put on this because I love this pot. Um, so I've got to decide what I'm going to put in here um, and get that ready for summer. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope I didn't bash your favorite plant too much. Um, but I appreciate you guys watching, and I hope to see you again in the future. You guys all have a great night. Thanks for watching.